Hey guys, just to, just to tell, let you know, I actually do have something to do with something on YouTube, and uh, it's pretty different, and yeah, I know all the content is also pretty different, but what am I doing here? Well, it's the whole community that I've been wanting to do this video for a long time ago which when I start which it was when I that long ago was when I first started YouTube it was no big deal or anything else it was just pretty beneficial so um if any of you guys uh, want to hear my side of the story that I hope we on YouTube well it's not that big of a process. I'm not telling you guys, but yeah, it's a big process to start YouTube. All this, these years, my mom helped me, but so did my own self. Helped himself, I guess. If that, if that actually makes sense to all of you people here on uh, YouTube. But by the way, I kind of do want to tell you how thankful I am, how great of a friend you guys all been to this channel for the past like around two to three years now and I just can't believe, I just cannot believe like how much I started this channel in 2020 and I'm still, uh, raging past my YouTube career as my YouTube career never started act never actually started in December it started in May May which year 2020 when the pandemic hit and what anyway when the pandemic hit I actually noticed that there's a lot of uh, YouTubers going around since now, online content, since then, online content has almost went mainstream, almost the rest of television networks decided to go all the way off air. What happened? It's because the reason why I had inspiration to make a YouTube channel was, um... Kalis. Yes, infinite lists. And yes, I even made a whole channel by a, by him. I even made a whole Facebook post about him. But that's still what I would ramble about nonetheless. So if I would ramble about something, it would be about what would I do to the channel in a few years. Because I might be accomplishing one of my biggest dreams since ABS-CBN shut it down completely from the Philippine television and media. Which, if you don't know, the ABS-CBN franchise renewal controversy started in 2014, not in around 2020 or so. Because 2020 was when the controversy was already reaching its peak. Yes, I know, the COVID-19 pandemic is almost over. Well, at least we say so. But 2020 is over. It's now 2023, the start of the new decade. I'm making a video. Okay. Because I'm not feeling that we're going to get... All right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Yeah, why is he... Anyways... One of the worst things that I've probably done in my whole life when I was going on YouTube was not even sleeping for a whole day in order to watch some people play Minecraft or making animations, all these stuff. What I would like is to get into the handmade TV network so that they could accomplish it later on. And uh, since... I haven't got into that yet because it's super duper hard for all us. 
And let me tell you, there's a lot of controversies through the years that I faced. Some were even addressed. I cannot believe like how much people actually cared about me when I was going all these, uh, all these tough times. But it wasn't a tough time when I learned from the first one. Introducing the worst bully ever, Aston. You know who's that? Well, that guy is totally... That guy was such a big bully on YouTube that he decided to... But when his April Fool's joke, he decided to call his viewers losers. I cannot believe that. What if I even called him a noob? Well, Aston, it started all the way in 2020, the same year when the abs cbn shutdown occurred, a few months after I started my career, and not, ma not, not many happened, but uh, I'm doing a video, what do you want me to do, just be silent for the rest of the video? Alright, I guess. Okay, sorry. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Things aren't going as planned. In order to make this video, I sort of have to, you know, grab onto it later on. Since Kalia's sleeping here. Yeah. What awkward. But since I'm in the video, I can't go back, so I guess I'm gonna have to continue on. Anyway, the Aston guy, that guy was named Aston, and he was, firstly, he was bullying one of my best friends. All of them, actually. Well, um, uh, he was bullying me. He was bullying Van. He was bullying Elliot. Well, if you don't know who those are, those are actually my YouTube friends. And now I remember the two. Completely bullying me. Again, they would, she was completely being, bullying me, Elliot, Vanny, and uh, also uh, he was bullying a lot of other people. He also thought there was a bot channel and I sort of agreed to him I was this whole drama started I was pretending to agree with him he loved he heard my comment and uh, at least he at least I'm pretending to agree I'm pretending to agree so Robloxy and Elliot or Elliot the youtuber I'll just call him uh, Elliot I guess that's probably his real name um, he got my comment and then he went over to and then he replied to me saying don't worry he's just trying to scare little kids yeah that's it that's exactly what he said to me and if you guys don't know 2021 rolled out when we still were still living at our old house at our old home we were we were pretty good, and at least I met a lot of people, a lot made a lot of friends in YouTube. It's just great. But from the second in drama, I learned, learned from the first. 2022, I still kept my Roshans, but I still kept my Roshans from the first one that happened two years prior, and since Nothing really was happening, I guess. I decided to attack a person. I I didn't want to do it. He was also being friends with the hacker from Shark, you know, Palm Green. Like, he was being friends with him, like, what the heck? So I just go ahead and say, dude, your videos suck. And he responded to me with terrible things, but at least I responded and fought back. Even though, uh, I know that if any of your viewers tell me to never fight back against these people, I did. And we won. It's over. 
it got over it pretty quickly because I was getting inactive. You know, I was watching videos, right? I did not leave. It's just all over. That's it. Done. Uns actually became nice after that. Probably. But if Uns, you're watching this, you suck, bro. Anyways. In favor of my dignity, I kind of do not know what to, how to say this, but like, she say was so. This is all for populating, but like, it's the best YouTube year ever because I literally got a heck ton of milestones. First up, I got 30, 20, and 40 subscribers. I got the 20 last year, and 25 also. And then 30 and 40. I'm still, and I achieved 50 this year. And also, pretty much, I passed my mom this year. If you don't know, my mom is now the last person in the family, the well, second to last person to have the most subscribers since I took control of the channel when it was created. Well, when I made my first video with it, I instead of creating my own Gmail, I decided to go on her Gmail because that's exactly what I locked on to. And I remember Grandma was watching things, and uh, you know, I know one difference. My cousin decided <laughs> to ruin my video after that. And it was a fun time. Everyone was supporting me. Well, until I got back on the new, new channel. I left that channel. That was until I left the channel, and uh, whew, my cousin doesn't support me anymore. That's the only thing I have to say. My cousins never support me anymore after I left the channel. After that, since I'm no longer a newbie, and I had a new channel, Boom, my cousin supports for me is has just degraded all the way back down to where they don't even support me anymore and just keep saying random stuff. <laughs> Such a tragedy. But at least I get to meet a lot of friends on the channel. Like Van, Elliot, uh what's that last one? I don't know, like Van's Benny six Manny's uh, sister and um, yeah I'm not trying to bully because actually I think it was just a baby blooper or something but uh yeah all you guys thank you all for supporting me having having courage in me having support and having beliefs that I will succeed so, I thank you all for watching my videos ever since. No, I'm not going to pass away or something. It's just a thank you message from me. So, since it's the 22nd of May and it's my career started on the 31st, I'm still uploading it early because um, I'll roll out the video on Facebook on May 31st. And, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, and keep on supporting me throughout my YouTube journey. Thank you for watching. Bye.